We've heard from so many families that they're they're thankful for what we're doing here as a school, that they that they love what we offer here. The Fields Are Right for School has a lot to do with the great interest that we've seen in Christian education in the last couple of years. In just over two years, we've grown by just a little over 50%. Right now, we cannot accept all the students who would love to come here. We have 164 kids enrolled and, I, I don't know, dozens on the wait list that continues to grow all the time. Yeah, it's disappointing when you especially read through some of the application questions that people will fill out, and I can see that, you know, we might be a great fit for them or that this is really what they're looking for, and we just we can't provide it for them right now. Three. So, when we see the interest and the demand that's out there, it's our chance to respond to that. The building project, the expansion that we'll see is five classrooms, one more that will be a science and art lab that's kind of a shared space for kindergarten through eighth grade. The new classrooms will be kind of a dedicated um, middle school wing, essentially. There'll be lockers for the kids, extra set of bathrooms. There will also be some smaller like pull-out spaces for students to be able to use, small group spaces. We've done a lot more to offer different services for students who have special needs or just require some extra in-school therapies. And so being able to do some of that work in kind of a smaller but flexible space is part of that project too. Where we're at right now is um, pretty tight on space. We have the classrooms that we're using, but we of course are using the, the church as a classroom, the gym as a classroom, so not a lot of space. Science has been an area that we've wanted to innovate in for a while. We've had a program actually picked out um, for now two years and just no space to put it yet. So being able to have um, a truly dedicated science lab that all of our students can use starting in kindergarten all the way through eighth grade is going to be um, amazing. To me it's huge to be able to continue expanding both the ways that we can support students who might have different needs and also the, the financial ways we can support families so that Christian education isn't just something that is for families who can easily afford it and have no problem with being able to come to school and don't need any extra um, like outside therapies. So um, we're thankful that the St. Andrew community has raised just over 2.7 million in I think just eight weeks, which is amazing. And we're really thankful for that. So we would invite our Westside families to prayerfully consider participating and and also help to make this vision possible. Families will be seeing um, information in the mail in the next couple weeks if, if you want to contribute, if you have questions about it, if you want to learn more about the project, uh, reach out and, and ask about it. Since the school has started, the mission has been to provide high quality Christian education. So we want to continue to innovate in the practices that we have and what we're providing for the academic side of things and also to make sure that we are, are having Jesus at the center of, of all of it that we're doing. Participating in the campaign right now could be a way for them to, to help support that mission, to be able to serve um, obviously their, their own family, but so many more families um, with this project as well.